sick mortal. It was nothing compared to what I had to do to break out of the afterlife. No, just cursed. There have been plenty of times that death seemed like a welcome change, however. I was dragged there by a powerful demon and things took an ugly turn. When I saw that rift, I wasted no time in making my escape. You have no idea. But should you ever spill innocent blood, I promise you shall find out someday. Doctor, I'm so glad you're here. Something is wrong. These portals... They're getting bigger? No. That must be a mistake. The spell you're casting... It, it's expanding the rift! You have to stop! I... cannot cease. Until all realities are one. So I am commanded by the dread Dormammu.
That was quite an impressive feat, but vanquishing the true Dormammu in his own realm will be nearly impossible. Lucky for us, the impossible is my specialty. for all of that unpleasantness. I will, but first we need to deal with Dormammu. That was no more than a shadow of his true power. He's the master of this dimension and can twist its dark magic to his whims. And it gets worse. Dormammu has an infinity stone. It's what opened the first rift between our dimensions. I tried to chase it here, but it was too late. I'm afraid so. And unless we stop him, he'll make every dimension as dark as this one. Stone's power. He's altering the fundamental properties of this dimension right down to our perception of it. Mama has imbued these mindless ones with his own essence. They won't be nearly as easy to defeat. I can't. 
that you carry similar ones already. You should be able to use these to erect a mystical shield. Block their attack and absorb the energy. Now, the crystals are more fragile than I expected. But there should be more as we traverse closer to Dormammu and the stone. and warp halls are giving me a bloody migraine. I'm beginning to think I should have stayed in hell. Yeah. Uh, 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 
toying with a reality stone's power. He's altering the fundamental properties of this dimension, right down to our perception of it. <laughs> the Kingpin had no idea the power he possessed. But I've been watching, and I now know what these crystals can do, in more experienced hands. Here. Let me show you. You heroes have no idea what you found, do you? I was keeping my eyes on you, but perhaps the time has come for fists instead. Crystals, isolate, call them what you will. Soon, they'll all be mine. And you thought one of me was hard to handle. <laughs> Take your spoils. I must admit, this alliance you've built is quite inspiring. <laughs> Perhaps I should craft one of my own. Hmm. <laughs> Oh, that was certainly unusual. Anyone know what that was all about? All that matters is that he is gone, that we have his crystals, and that Dormammu lies ahead. But 
This realm makes even my head spin. You know, I'm suddenly kind of glad I didn't have those tacos after all. Because I'd probably be spewing them back into my mask about now. If only that were the last of him. He always does. He's lived for centuries thanks to the foul magic in this place. We've only made him angrier. We get the Reality Stone as far away from here as possible. I think I can help with that, but it will take a few moments. Good. Take a moment to regroup, and we'll depart this wretched place once and for all. This was all my fault. We never would have ended up in this terrible dimension if my magic wasn't so volatile. Maybe you're right. My hexes may not always have the expected results, but I suppose they still manage to get the job done. Of course, I remain forever by your side. Time to go home then, yeah? Oh, that wasn't the plan, love. I'm not a hero like you. Just a girl who happens to hunt the things that go bump in the night. And it's been a long night. 
From everything I've heard, he does sound like a bit of a monster himself. Oh, fine. But if we kill him, I get to keep his head for my trophy room. Deal? What a dreadful debacle this devolved into. Oh, it still stands strong. It has merely been temporarily trumped by the megalithic magician and his flaming facade. Indeed, a fortuitous finding we could never have anticipated upon arriving in this dismal dimension. I am excited to examine it upon returning. Calm your concerns, comrade. This sapphire scientist has friends with formidable facilities all over our world. And on countless others. You cannot destroy the darkness. He's right, you know. Dormammu feeds off this dimension's endless arcane energies. He can't die in this place. But we most definitely can. And if Dormammu spills this black magic into our world, he would be unstoppable there, too. Of course, without the Reality Stone, he can't merge our dimensions together. And without the darkness to fuel him, he wouldn't last long. So, if I can open a portal back to our plane of existence, perhaps we can take the stone somewhere safe. <gasps> or at least, somewhere safer than this. We came here to escape the chaos of Earth. Our people were trapped at the heart of far too many conflicts over the centuries. Assailed from all sides by those who wish to harm or exploit us. Only by removing ourselves from their world would we ever truly hope to find peace. So, tell us, my dear. Why have you opened our doors to the same chaos we fought so hard to leave behind? No matter how we may try to cut ourselves off from our home planet, my queen, we still have friends and allies who need our help. Who are we to ignore their plight? We are inhumans. As both humans and mutants alike have repeatedly reminded us. We stand alone. And unless your friends can convince the king otherwise... ...so do they. is willing to get her hands dirty. You are the best. You got it. <laughs> <laughs> 